After a recent outbreak in Wilmer, the first case of canine influenza was confirmed in the Brainerd Lakes area over the weekend. The case was discovered in a two-year-old dog named Bella after the dog was coughing up blood, had a runny nose, as well as a fever the day after the dog was adopted. Doctors at Lakeland Veterinarian Hospital in Baxter diagnosed the case. It said the vaccinations are the key to stopping the spread of the potentially fatal disease. It's a newer disease. Not many veterinary clinics are vaccinating. Many people don't know about it. Um, so there are too many animals that aren't vaccinated. So the vaccine right now, there's two, several vaccines. Um, the one we carry is what's called a bivalent, which means it actually covers for both strains of the flu. Initially, dogs need two of them about two to four weeks apart. And then after that, it is once a year to keep the protection going. Doctors say the symptoms of canine influenza mirror those of human influenza, including runny nose, cough, shortness of breath, and fever. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.